Mmm, animal crackers in the morning. I touch them as little as possible because I don't want to get sick and I love don't animal bite your crackers. Nails. That's how she's gonna get me to stop biting my nails. She's just gonna start painting gluten on them. <laughs> if I get sick, she'll be like, I know, I know what you did. <laughs> now everyone knows your sins. <laughs> it's that time again. Morning. And it's that place again. The Kyle family vlog. The Kyle family vlog with Tibbs rubbing his head against the back of my legs for some reason. Thank you, Tibbs. So. Always a pleasure. Two things to say. First, after the vlog the other day, I had a number of friends uh, reach out that were very nice. So thank you. I love you all. I had not expected that, so I was a little uh, overwhelmed by it. But the other thing is, remember how I complained about talking on the phone last night? Well, guess what I woke up to this morning? More talking on the phone. Guess what I have to do in like the next hour? More talking on the phone. Guess what I have to do after that? More talking on the phone. Hi, I'm Sean, and now I talk on the phone. Sucks for you. I'm sure my turn will come soon enough. So last night when we took Hectate up behind the school with us and he was having a really good time running around chasing sticks and stuff and today he's limping pretty badly. Every so often we go up to that park and he comes back with a little limp because I don't know. I think that he does better on grass. I don't think just looking at tips don't step. Hey, don't step on Hecky. Yeah, I saw that. Um, <clears throat> I don't think that he's hurt badly. He's not acting like it. It's something that he's done a number of times, but it does get frustrating when you go to the same spot a number of times and he comes back with the same limp a number of times after you go nowhere else. Only that spot. Yes, poor Hecky. So, his back left leg is bothering him. We're just going to keep an eye on it for probably today and tomorrow and... Um, there's a slight improvement already from yesterday, so we're not overly concerned. But I'm sorry your paw is bothering you, Hecky. You're such a good boy. Yeah, we love you, buddy. Okay, Tibbs, where are we? Why? Oh, we're at the puddle. <laughs> we're at the puddle at Walmart. Wow! Let's walk on the side. <laughs> you only got a little, a little bit wet. Sean's back there taking a business call and he's like, he's like, I need to walk while I take this call. So we just parked on the far side and I was like, see ya, I'll be inside. <laughs> Bless him for doing so much. He does so much of that nitty gritty type of stuff that kind of sucks with business, but he's so good at just saying, you know, this has to be done and here we go. Would you like to ride the horse, son? I'll hold you in case it's violent. Can't go. trust these machines. <laughs> hey, that's not giddy bad. Giddy up, giddy up, giddy up. Woohoo! Give <laughs> Yeah, you're riding me. Yeah. Good job. Yeah. Was that fun? Hold on to the saddle. Hold on tight. There you go. Oh, how cute. It's just your size, Tibbs. Perfect. It's so cute just holding on. And... Is that fun? You can feel a little tired. <laughs> We're trying to find Tip's slippers because he gets cold feet. His little cold, stinky feet. Um, and he likes the shark slippers, so we're going to try those. And... Yeah, sometimes I have him sleep in socks to help keep his feet warm, but a lot of the socks that we have right now um, kind of cut into him just, a, just enough that uh, he still struggles with cold feet sometimes, you know? Like, mm. I don't want him to have his circulation cut off, so I'm trying to find something else. Tibbs likes these little... You like these got, little sharkies? They've got zippers for mouths, I will show you. See? Look at that mouth. It's a zipper. I can do this one-handed, so we go... Boy, and it closes. why are your feet so sticky? <laughs> I can't get them in. Are these smaller than they look? I thought this was the right size, but it's the right size. Those are the right size. I think his feet here. are I'll here. Yes, the magic dad touch. Sean always does this stuff better than me. It's because his... Because you were the big brother, that's why. I was a little one, I didn't do anything. <laughs> <laughs> is that a fun shoe? My only hesitation is that will he actually keep them on or does he just think it's like a fun looking toy almost? He knows what shoes are. 
He does. He does know what shoes are. Okay, so my official decision is I tried to put on the other one and it's really hard to get on him for some reason. I think you might have fat feet like your mom. Sorry, kiddo. Let's see if we can find a different kind that might slip on a little better. These things, as cute as they are, just they don't go on easy at all. And so these we're trying these. Slipped on really these easy. slipped on really easily. And uh, with him being a little clumsier, it's probably better to have the small ones. How do you like those, Tibby? Will those keep your feet warm when you're home? Yep. And they're only five bucks. <laughs> I love that. What you doing, Tib Tib? Good morning, Tibs. Hello, it's me, your mother. <laughs> Hi. Yeah. <coughs> Crayons are more entertaining, I suppose. This boy right here, Nat and I have speculated that his favorite color is orange. He gets excited for orange things. There's like a... Uh, he loves to eat them. Yeah, he loves... <laughs> uh, well, he loves to play with he loranges. Loves play he with loves, them. loves the neighbor's kayak, which is orange. Anyways, I just came over and I said, Tibbs, what's your favorite color? And he rustled around and found... I think it's over here. Here we go. He found this right here, held it up and said, favorite orange and then put it over there, so. I think it's official. I, th I was pretty impressed. I didn't even think he understood me, and then he managed to get out the word favorite and the word orange. Good job, Tibbs. So, I think his favorite color is orange. Now Which, I know what color of thing to buy you. My favorite color is red. Her favorite color <laughs> is yellow, so, I mean, it's It's, it's, it's just suiting. perfect. Yeah. Tis the season, pumpkins and roasted green chilies. It's that time again. Morning. And it's that place again. <laughs> With Tibbs in the stroller. What's up, y'all? I'm wow. glad you're here checking out my YouTube channel. This is where I post all my cool stuff so that and people know how awesome I am. percent of the viewers. <sighs> Sean's mean to me. I I'll come back it. later. Patio, dog friendly. It's bigger than you think. Quiet, fire pit, please come visit the patio, somebody, please. And here we be. Making sure Tibbs gets to look at the water, water, water. Also, very exciting news, I have quarters for laundry. What else? Uh, pizza for dinner, I'm excited for that. Heck yeah. Hey, we know we did it last week, okay? And we liked it, so we're doing it again. Hey Tibbs, it's hard to take pictures of. <laughs> He's sneaky. We'll pull out our phone and like take a, a picture or whatever. And we'll be like, Tibbs, look over here. And he only ever gives us like look half that. a second. Like as soon as I look, you better take it because I'm busy. <laughs> Hi Tib Tib. Sure do love you, bud. I am so glad it's Saturday, Saturday. Can you throw that rock? Oh yeah. Get it, Tibbs, throw it. Yeah, good throw. The doctor said he had good throwing reflexes or something like that, I don't remember. He complimented us on his throwing abilities. I was like, well, thank you. I deserve that. There is that face. I just need more of this in my life, you know? Yeah. She and I are basically like planning on working our butts off for the next X amount of years until we can just have like this all the time. And all of the other needs are taken care of. Anything that comes up is just taken care of and we can have a little more like quality time more often. I'm looking forward to that. Yeah, Nat and I don't need like... The truth is, I do want a nice house. It's not like huge or anything, but Nat and I have been talking about our, our home for a while and we have kind of a design and stuff. That's my big consumer thing, my one big consumer thing in life. I don't need the newest car, I'm not a... I, 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 I would be happy off. with a large enough yard to go play frisbee in yeah. <laughs> with my family. And, yeah, uh, and you have a mosquito on your forehead. Okay, time to run. They keep coming. There's another one. It's just ah, oh, you missed it. 
It's just on my hand. Oh no. All right, time to get out of here. I don't want to be up mosquitoed. I don't want to get it. <laughs> oh my gosh, you're so tired. <laughs> oh, my lower back, bro. He loves it. <laughs> This is my life now, guys. Look, this is all tip stuff. Look over there. Okay, that's this is ours. That's our fault. We were playing, and I haven't cleaned that up yet, so that's my bad. But stuff like this, I already cleaned up stuff after like you this. once today, son. Why are you bringing the pan out? You're a horrible person. Tips, come back come over here. I want to show you something with a coin. I want to show you something. Watch. I'm going to make a picture of this coin. Put it there. Take the crayon. He's been telling us colors. I asked him. Did I ask him stuff like, what color is that crayon? And like he says, green now. Look at this. Blue. That's You're blue. You're teaching him wrong? <laughs> I, 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 no, we were, he and Just I were kidding. talking about a green crayon earlier. Tibbs, look. You can see the penny. Look. Whoa! Kate, he was so happy he found a one? dime at the store today on the floor. He did, it was so cute. Watch, put the dime right here. Okay, now we put the paper over it. Do you want to do it? Yeah. Just rub it right here. Right here. On top of the coin. Yeah. Mm hmm. Oh, I see a circle. Oh boy, what else will we see? I don't know if we'll see much more. Wow, it's like you can see the coin. Magic. I don't, I don't think he's, he's, he's he like, seems eh, to be having fun, okay. but I'm not sure that he's completely enthralled Shh. by it yet. Give him another like year or two. I'm a boring mother. Where are you going? This is his life anymore. I run around the place and pick stuff up and move it to some place it shouldn't be. He really does. He likes Thanks for to the like little cuddle. Organize things and categorize them. Hey. I'm trying to subtly uh, hide the uh, the table mess in the background. Yeah, you should be hiding that table mess. <laughs> it's pretty bad. Yeah. In other news, this cat is so cuddly. She just won't leave me alone. Daddy, People daddy, who know her know that's pretty much normal Daddy, she it's true. she went through about six months where she wasn't as happy with me for some reason and then uh one day it turned off and she was back to i i can't be without your lap dad oh yeah here you go i want pizza I why want is it not done too. yet why isn't it done ever since we did the fort here the other day tibbs has been saying fort tunnel fort tunnel so we're gonna set the fort back up. We're gonna give him his little tunnel so that he can crawl through. <laughs> tunnel, yeah. We're gonna make your tunnel, huh? And it looks like we are missing the race for the cure on the way to church today. So much pink. So much pink. We didn't even we didn't even need to ask. We were just it like, like goes all the way into the park. There's yeah, like there's there's stuff all the way up through there. We didn't even need to ask. We were just like, look at all that pink. We're on our way to church. I have a bad migraine. I don't think I'm going to make it through all of church today, but we're on our way to church. How are you, little Tibbs? We were all ready to go. We don't put his hat on him anymore, by the way. We just tell him we're going to leave, and we look over, and he has his hat on. He just goes and gets it. How are you doing? Uh, I'm doing pretty good. My eyes are actually a bit tired. Some little baby was like sleeping on my glasses or something and I couldn't find him this morning and I'm very blind without them so I've had my contacts in since like seven <laughs> yeah I woke up at like just after seven and she was up working on the vlog yeah <laughs> it was just one of those mornings I woke up early and uh, I was like yeah sure we are in the midst of restructuring our days again because uh, Silver and Zeus has been pretty neglected by us for a while. It really has. And we're not at the point where we can dedicate a lot of time to it yet. I mean, it will be a little while before we can do that. And we're still saving up for a little bit before we actually buy another camera. So there's going to be the scratch on the lens and etc. But 
we're at the point where we can uh, dedicate half an hour to an hour every day to actually working on stuff, so I have a list of things from, you know, new things for the vlog to actually finishing up several songs that are that close to being done. Yeah. I'm gonna go sit there this coming week, make a list, and start checking them all off. So you might actually see little improvements coming. Some new stuff coming out, putting plants together. We're excited. We missed it. It's making music is one of our favorite things to do, I think. Yes. Yes? We are in the middle of driving up the hill. Ah. What are we going to go do, Nat? Up the yeah. winding mountain, Scott. Yes, Tip says Scott. We're yep. going to go have dinner with him and his family. Yep. So, up the hill we go. Tibbs finished his nap earlier than I wanted to finish my nap, so he got up and I was like, no, nah, but I am excited to go eat. Um, thank you for joining us today. Um, come back tomorrow if you liked it. Okay, uh, subscribe and share. Good night. subscribe if you liked it thumbs up if you liked it comment